referee looks at his watch. Any second now. Hello. Hello! Welcome back to Want My Bet TV. My name's Will. I'm Oli. And I'm Tom. We're here every week talking through upcoming fixtures and our predictions for the weekend. This is true. Same again. We're back. Same again. A little bit of admin. A little bit of admin. Um, if you don't know, we've got a WhatsApp group. The number's down at the bottom. All you've got to do is join that and you get tips across all sports direct to your phone every single day. The other bit of admin is, obviously, we've done the research so you guys don't have to, but... Don't take every single tip we say and put it all in one acre and then moan when it doesn't come in. A ten Because you'll lose. Pick and choose. Yeah, pick those. Throw in, throw a little curveball in if you fancy Treble, fourfold, yeah, fivefold, yeah, yeah, maybe yeah. push the boat out. But a few of your own selections That's in there. max. Yeah, exactly Unless that. you're extra risky. <laughs> cool. All right, so Straight first in. game. And put your bets in the comments as well. Yeah, we like to see those. Southampton versus Chelsea. I've gone pretty rogue. Is it a banana? Oh, you've got the same. I, th I think this is banana skin. Yeah. I've gone Southampton to win either half. Same here. Because Southampton are fighting for their lives. Chelsea basically yeah. are going to finish fifth. Mm -hmm. So it's like um, pretty standard. Chelsea have lost five of their last eight Premier League games. Yeah, they're not doing well. Absolute They've only won free fall. two in their last eight. But that run has been tough. They've had City, United, Barca, Tottenham, West Ham. No, West this Ham. is in the league. Oh, in the league, league yeah. games have okay, yeah. lost. Well, this is the Having last eight. Having a stinker. Yeah. Two True West Ham at home. Oh, mate, they're poor. Um, yeah. They're not playing. I think Southampton were a little bit unlucky against Arsenal as well. They've yeah, got the, they were. They look like they've got that grit and determination to try and fight to stay up. Mm -hmm. They're at home. They're against the Chelsea, who are a bit wobbly at the moment. Conte's probably out anyway. True. Don't give a shit. Yeah, he's um, gone. I think Southampton either half is good value. Me too. 2.6 is great value. Um, what are you going I, for, I just think Chelsea need to pick up some form. I'm not. I can't really call that either way because it is a banana. But I'm yeah. just going to go Morata any time. Oh, the superstar striker that's been banging them in. <laughs> well, it's got half a no, back. The last, well, only a few games ago, he scored two and two. Oh, right. well, now he's got oh, two well and four. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, so he's do a goal. Do a goal. <laughs> All right, next. <laughs> Three p.m. Burnley versus Leicester. This is seventh versus eighth. I think that looks like both teams to score. I agree with you. Both teams to score. I've gone Burnley win. Oh, yeah, no, I can see that. Yeah, I think uh, Leicester have been pretty poor recently. Uh, they've drawn three of the last four games, um, and Burnley have won four of their last five. Both teams to score. Yeah. yeah, and Burnley are pushing for Europe, so you know. Burnley are flying. Burnley have only lost one of their last eight. Yeah, so Burnley are flying. Although normally we would go, oh, that's that's a dud, nil nil, one all, or whatever. Yeah. Or you'd say 1-0 Burnley, that normal. Or 1-0 Burnley. <laughs> uh, no, I, just, I think Burnley could edge it. Four of the last five Burnley games have seen both teams to score, and they've been over 2.5 goals in Burnley's last four games. You wouldn't think that. No. But that, I think there's goals in that. And Leicester have had both teams to score in their games more than any other team. Yeah, true. Right. Both true. teams to score. Next, Palace versus Brighton. Palace this, win. This is always a... Palace win. This is a derby. This is a derby, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. it's a derby. I've gone Palace win. I think mm. that's, that's, that's pretty sure. Um, I've gone Zaha any time. Yeah, I yep. can see that as well. He though. looked like the only sign of, well, main sign of danger. With his new barnet. Yeah, with his new barnet. Long hair. Where did that come from? Clip on or something. Yeah, it's got to be. <laughs> Milivojevic. 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 Oh, him. He's good he is well. also their yeah. danger man. Banging well, in not, goals. He's the penalty taker, isn't and he? And scored yeah. the free kick. You see that free yeah, kick he scored? Yeah, it's great free so kick. So, great goal. He, him. You could say him any time as well. Yeah. But, but that'd be like massive odds. Yeah. But he scored 10 in, well, 10 this season, including the last three games. Mate, he's banging in goals. But I just can't see Brighton scoring there. He scored fewer away goals than anyone else. Yep. And they failed to score in seven of their last nine. Yeah, they've the only scored seven goals away from home all season. Exactly. So that's yeah. why Palace well, just, should edge that. Palace, Palace will Palace score. Will Palace will score. They've yeah. scored in each of their last five games. Yeah. And I just think they're they've just been so unlucky. They've lost the last three home games by one goal. And even been, even just the Palace win isn't bad odds. No, no. One point nine. Yeah, that's good. Next, Huddersfield versus Watford. Cool. This is a corker. I've gone both teams to score again. Have you? Mine's yeah. mine's. A touch rogue, I think. What you got? I've gone Huddersfield to win. Ooh, not sure about that. Yeah. I've gone under 2.5 yes. goals. I don't know how many goals there'll be in there. Oh, Watford have my, conceded my. 10 goals in their last three away <laughs> games. 
There's been 32 There's goals 100 scored in the last seven it. meetings between these sides, which is an average of 4.6 a game. Yeah. Between these two sides? Yeah. Yeah, probably like in the championship or something. <laughs> no. No. There's, there's got, there's got, there'll be goals in this. Watford are conceding goals for fun. Conceded 10 in the yeah. last three games. Yeah, but Huddersfield aren't exactly banging them in, are they? No, but I think Huddersfield are scrapping for their lives. If Huddersfield win that game, they're basically safe. Mm. Or pretty much safe. Watford have got nothing to play for. They've got 37 points. They need like a point or something. I think it's a bit of a nothing game. If I was to change my uh, tip, it would be Watford either half. I can't see that either. Watford are terrible away from home. I can see it. Watford are good at home. Watford are horrendous away from home. But they've got a decent squad. You, I don't care if they're away. Nah, they're terrible away. I'm going. Huddersfield win. I right. fancy it this week. Next. Swansea versus Everton. Oh, I've gone Swansea win. I've gone Swansea win. It's a little Swansea bit rogue. Win. I've gone draw. Do I can see a draw? That's probably more likely. One win, like, potentially. But I've, uh, this week, I've just gone for teams that have something to play for. Yeah, Everton, it's about that time of the season, isn't it? Everton are basically mid-table, mm. bang average, probably get rid of the uh, Big Sam at the end of the season, playing in their slippers, with their pipe. True. Swansea are going to be battling for everything, throwing themselves in front of everything. Mm. Um, and Swansea are amazing, well, doing really well at home. Carver has won seven of his last nine home games as Swansea boss in all competitions. And Everton are terrible away from home. But they have only lost one of their last four in the league. Yeah. So that's why I draw. They've oh, just been grinding out the like shit performances. Only so Brighton, those Stoke and West Brom have picked up fewer away points than Everton. Everton have the fourth worst away And record. those four home games for Swansea included Arsenal and Liverpool. Yeah, wins. Swansea at home are good. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I fancy, <laughs> I fancy Swansea as well. <laughs> What's next? Uh, uh, there's random kickoff times. So it's Liverpool Bournemouth at 5.30 on mm -hmm. Saturday. What you boys got? Salah, any time. I mean, I've gone Salah any time, but it's rubbish odds. Yeah, well, they're at home against Bournemouth who concede goals. But then you'd, I don't know who they're going to start with. They might, be, they might rest a few players, I don't know. I don't think they will. They, but they Salah's already had a little bit of a race. No, but I was thinking if you were to go for, like, Firmino or something. Better, much better odds. I think. So you just Salah any time, get him in an acca. Oh, it's, I mean, if he gets a goal, doesn't he break the record of scored the most yeah. games in the Premier League? Like of, of in a season, so, yeah. thirty-two, I think it will be. Or th and he's or one of few who's even scored more than thirty. In Mate, he's flying. Season. Absolutely scored eight flying. in the last five competitive yeah. games. <laughs> he's unbelievable. unbelievable. I've gone Liverpool half time, Liverpool full time. Just all the stats back this up. Um, Liverpool have scored at least two goals in their last seven matches. Mm. Have been winning at full time and half time in the last three home games. Undefeated in the last eighteen. Bournemouth have failed to win in nine of the last ten away games. There you go. Get your tips up in the comments as well. Then you've got the big one. The big one, yeah. Tottenham versus Man City at 7.45. Really yeah. random, random. kickoff times again. Uh, what have you boys gone for? Both teams to score, I think that's safe. I've gone for yeah. Spurs win. I have as well. It, I, it, I, hate, <laughs> I hated writing it down. Wait, City have lost their last three games in a row yeah. in all competitions. Yeah, I, I thought that if they won this game, no, they won the league, but no, United, United won. caught them yeah, up, yeah, yeah. so they didn't. I yeah. mean, they're still going to win the league, but I just think, you know, Spurs will like Spurs won't want them yeah. to win this. They want to try and delay it as much as they can. Big time. Harry Kane's still trying to scrap every single That's what goal. I mean. Tottenham have still got something to play for, because they just still need aren't to... Tottenham on the longest unbeaten run in the league at the yeah. moment? Yeah, undefeated in 2018. Un yeah. Unbeaten in the last team, last Premier League. Yeah. 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 So um, Kane any time as well could be a shout. Yeah, yeah, it's a good shout. Spurs have won their last four home games, and have only lost one game at Wembley all season. Mm. City have conceded eight goals in the last three games. Yeah, I just think it Kinda. could be a little two-one Spurs. That yeah. I think it's just both teams to score is just on. A little yeah. two-one Spurs. Harry Kane will probably notch. Um, Sunday, Sunday, Newcastle Arsenal. I've, I don't I've gone both like teams to score this. again. I've I gone banana don't. skin. I don't like this one. I've gone Newcastle win. I've gone Newcastle. I've gone half. the same. Either half, yeah. Because the odds are good for that as yeah, well. Yeah, great odds. And also the fact that Newcastle are playing all right. They've won their last three games. Yeah. Arsenal oh. lost their last four away games. They haven't picked up a point away in, in 2018. 2018. I know. <laughs> That's mad. The last, but the last point we got away from home was against West Brom when we drew one all <laughs> oh on, my God. on New Year's Eve. Really? So it's not even like oh. the, the game wow. before was good. I mean, all the stats say that this is a banana skin, but you just never know, do you? Newcastle have won, yeah, like you say, they've won. Arsenal have lost their last four away games. I just, 
even against CSK, Arsenal lost the first half. Mm. Away from home, Arsenal are shaky. That's why I think it's another both teams to score one. There's loads of both teams to score. I think there's a lot of goals. Yeah, I would put loads that, of both yeah, teams is. to score. Yeah, I quite like that. Um, then United versus West Brom. United clean sheet. I nearly did that. And then I was just like, better odds for this. I've gone Lukaku any time. Was it better teams. odds? Much better odds, really, yeah. yeah. It's 1.45. Fair enough. I've gone uh, United half-time, United full-time. Triple captain Lukaku, by the way. Yeah, game your fantasy week. team. Got to get on that. Um, um, it's a bit of one of those games. It's, not, it's like the Liverpool game. There's not much value in that. Much. Yeah. Half-time, full-time is a good shout. United have won the last five home games. There's yeah. 50 points between the two of them. Yeah. <laughs> that is They've mental. kept 11 clean sheets at home. <laughs> yeah, uh, so that's one United will probably keep a clean sheet. Yeah. But West Brom have scored in the last five games. Mm. So they're not getting thumped by anyone, but they're, they're could, still losing. Could be a thumping. Um, West Brom haven't won in 15 games. Everyone knows that for well. Yeah, yeah, nice. Monday? Monday night, West Ham Stoke. I've gone simple. I've just gone West Ham win. I think West Ham will win, but I've gone Anatovic any time. How have you spelt Anatovic? Ah, now obviously. <laughs> right. <laughs> How else would you spell it? Uh, I'm right. tired. I've gone Anatovic any time as well. How are you meant oh, to spell it? Like that. Correctly. <laughs> oh, wow. Is that right? Mate, you've <laughs> Phonetically. Only, I think you've only got three letters right. <laughs> wow, good. Well played. The A. I think the A is the only one right. <laughs> a. Uh, it's only one letter off. Ends with an H. That's yeah. ridiculous. Without the H, it's exactly right. <laughs> uh, okay, fine. Yeah. Um, yeah, I've got West Ham win. West Ham have scored in five of the last six games. <laughs> Stoke have only picked up eight points away from home. Stoke are getting relegated. Yeah. Yeah. Now Stoke, Stoke, Southampton and West Brom relegated. Yeah, agreed. Agreed. Arnautovic has scored five in his last four games. Oh, Arnautovic. Banging them in. Banging in. Goals And fun. he scored in the reverse fixture. And it's his former side. Yeah. Oh, it's his so former side, yeah. And he's got a new barnet. And like, since, he's got, since his new barnet, well, since his new barnet, he's been banging them in. Right. No, he's a good player. Solid he's a great player. player. Great player. Um, what was it? Evra calls him my beast. Did you see that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my so beast. Jokes. And that's which any time in that one. All right. Nice. Right. Akers. My ones. I like the look of my one. And I said it to you boys before this and you liked it. So I'm going with it. Fourfold Acker. I've got... Palace Brighton, Palace win. Yeah, all agreed with. Like that. Burnley Leicester, both teams to score. Yes. Swansea Everton, Swansea either half. Yes. Keep playing it a little bit yeah, safer. Yeah, yeah. Huddersfield Watford, Huddersfield either half. Ooh. Yeah, I do I think that all come in. Has. Ten pound repay uh, pays nearly one hundred and forty quid. Yeah. That is coming in. I like that. Go on, you go. I've got similar odds, so I've gone like what we said. Loads of goals. Yep. Burnley, Leicester, both teams to score. Got that in mind. Huddersfield, Watford, both teams to score. Spurs, City, both teams to score. Yeah. Newcastle, Arsenal, both teams to score. Yeah. And United, clean sheet, chuck it in there as well. The only one is that Watford, Huddersfield. But that could easily could happen be a, as well. I think it will be. Could easily happen. That could be a nil-nil. I quite like that though. The stats are saying that Huddersfield will win that because mm. Watford are so bad away. Yeah, Watford but are horrendous away. Huddersfield are leaky. You get, they, that's true. I think that, could, that could easily happen. So £10 pays 145, 144 quid. Oh, you're getting closer and closer to me every week. Yeah, no. Every week. I Someone's win, don't I? fly the flag for Go rogue, on then. rogue hackers, haven't Go they? On then. Here he is, Mr Rogue himself. <laughs> Fivefold. Okay. We've got um, Zaha to score any time against Brighton. Like yeah. that. Both teams to score Newcastle Arsenal. Yeah. Like that. Burnley to win either half against Leicester. Like yes. that. Then the rogue ones. Watford to win either half. I mean, yeah. my one could still could come in. That. I could go either way that game. So. And Everton to win either half. Again, Again could yeah, go either way. £10 gets you 374 Yeah. Quite like that as well. Big odds for that. Yeah, that's what Big I odds pretty that. good value. I've just gone the other way, keep it a little bit more safe. But it could be one. Yeah. My, my Acker was one goal off last week. It was Brighton. Let me mm. know. Ditto. Same yeah. game. And that was a decent accurate. Well, ours was pretty game. similar last yeah. week. It was just a Brighton. Close. Three We're getting off. close. All right. So get your Ackers in the comments. Let's see if these ones come in. Come on. Good luck to everyone. We'll see you next week. See you yeah. later. Now then, is the referee looks at his watch. Any second now.